Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video and today uh, we're going to be opening up some gold premium jumbo packs for the new team of the week that just came out. If you guys are following me on Twitter or just following anybody else on Twitter, you probably have already seen this team of the week so I'm going to run through it pretty quickly. But as you can see there are 90 overall, Vladimir Tarasenko this week. Let's hopefully we can pull one of those as well as Ryan Johansson, Thomas Tatar, pretty sick first line. And there is also a second line of gold players you can pull. Uh, Tyler Ennis, he's like a five foot nine, yeah, five foot nine, one hundred and seventy pounds. He's gonna be a quickster out there, as well as Charlie Coyle, Tanner Pearson, and we got a we got some silver players as well as some uh, bronze players there as well. If you want to pull those, I'm not gonna go ahead and say their names. I'm gonna probably butcher them, so we're just gonna go on to the defense here. And for the defense, I'm probably gonna butcher this guy's name, but Ghostus Bear. You got uh, the Philadelphia fans can let me know. Ghostus Bear is that how you say it? There's also uh, Darling, we got Dumba in there as well, with Klein, Diaz, Richmond, and Harper. So a pretty nice Team of the Week this week. Definitely got a lot better than the previous two Team of the Weeks that we've already seen. So we're going to be opening up 20 of those Gold Premium Jumbos. That's like 350k worth of packs. So we're going to get this opened up, and we're going to see if we can get anything good. Alright, so you guys know, we're going to start right at the back, and uh, we're just going to keep opening up from there. So... Let's get this pack open. I've also been watching the Blue Jays recently. Just watching them clinch the AL East. Pretty sick. Alright, first pack. Oh my goodness. Look at all those like non-rare gold players. We got Grice, uh, Johnson, Lyles, McKenzie, Barbario, Jokinen. No one good at all in that pack that I could actually take. A uh, bunch of jerseys, a couple coaches, but that is just about it. And my pack luck has not been too good recently after... After that past couple pack openings, I have not pulled anything good, so I'm hoping to turn that luck around this episode. Maybe pull that Vladimir Tarasenko, Tarasenko. He's probably going for a lot right now. And look at that, we get Dirty Rivero. I see him in the background. He's got some pretty nasty hands. Let's see how much he's worth. 600 for Raymond. Uh, Ribeiro, still eight. he's only worth 800 now. That's pretty crazy. Malcolm Subban. Uh, Jared Cowan, there was there was a Jared Cowan there. A New York Rangers jersey I don't have yet, so I'll take that gladly. And yep, we'll send that to the collection and we'll move on to the next pack. Alright, so this is going to be the third pack here. And come on, we got a lot to get through. Oh, look at that! What a full Gabriel Landeskog. 88 overall worth 60,000 coins. That is what I'm talking about. I will gladly take him. 88 overall. Uh, we also got Artem Anisimov. Anybody at the back? I don't think so. That was a pretty sick pack. Washington Capitals jersey. Uh, Mark Stone. But that is a pretty sick pull for the third pack. Not going to not gonna complain about that at all. Let's quick sell that pack. Move on. And that is pretty good. I've been opening up a lot of those collection packs. I know a lot of you guys have been uh, wondering where the collection series is. Uh, I'm going to be making a giant compilation of all the packs I just opened. Because I kind of just flew through that series. And look at that. We got one of the new team of the weeks. Charlie Coyle. Oh man, there's two available of him already, but look at that. Six foot three, 220 pounds. That is a sick pull. We'll definitely keep him. There's Josh Bailey there. I think that's his name at least. Uh, Nita Ryder, uh, assistant captain. And that is just about it. But Charlie Coyle, two packs in a row. Pretty sick. All right, we still got so many to get through. Come on. Last pack was pretty garbage. I didn't even want to show it. But this pack, we're going to get uh, Brad Marchand. I see someone in the back, Alexander Semin. Uh, I think that was him. Marshawn, Nelson, those guys aren't worth anything. We also got a Runblad. Well, let's take a look at the back. I'm pretty sure, yep, we got Alexander Semin. Worth actually 7,000 coins. That's pretty uh, nasty still for a card. Definitely keep him. Uh, no, I'm not going to keep the contract, but Alexander Semin, another pretty good pull. Not going to lie. Anything above like 5k at this point is pretty solid. And it's pretty good that the players are still worth that value. I mean, NHL 15, it would have been worth like nothing i'm glad to see that there's some 84 85 overalls that are still pretty expensive in the game and going on to the next pack i see alexander burrows i see a bxa in the background porter clen denning uh i think we got two gold rare players at the back but that is just about it yep we're not going to keep those guys just quick sell them move on to the next pack on to the next pack come on i think this one is my sixth or seventh so let's keep going here come on show us a 90 overall pull Oh man, there is nothing there at all. Uh, Joris, Joris, and Newverth, uh, Nieto, Klo, any players at the back, 2,000 coin bonus, plus 9 skating. Once again, just nothing. I'm not going to keep anything. Just fills up the consumables too fast at this point. Alright, so we're going to keep going here. Puck total is definitely going up just by the quick sell value, so hopefully that will stay up there. Come on. 
Let's get another good pack here. Come on! Oh, Johnny Gujro. Gujro is actually worth a little bit. Let's take a look. 7,000 coins as well. He's kind of like the same value as Alexander Semen. Uh, Mark Savard. Two Savards at the same time. Uh, what's this guy's name? Mark Savard. David Savard. Mark Savard and David Savard. Halas Chuck. I think I saw a rare player in the back. Look at that. Two rare players. Nick Letty worth 2,800. I'll definitely take him. Uh, Ekholm and uh, Joris as well. So once again, send that to the collection. We'll move on to the next pack. So far, it's been pretty good. Um, three, four solid players worth about like 7,000 plus. That Gabriel Landeskog, definitely pretty solid pull. So we're moving on to the next one. I'm going to try skip pack. We're just going to try it out. And uh, we're going to get Jonathan Bernier. Uh, not bad overall. Worth 1,500 coins. I'll take him for a little bit. Uh, we'll sell him off a little bit later. Let's take a look at the back of the pack. Fiddler! Change team Detroit. Another Toronto Maple Leaf. Jake Garner in there. He was playing pretty well in the preseason games the exhibition game so i don't know i'm not looking too forward to the leafs playing this season i mean they've got lp by buffalo pretty badly that four nothing loss oh man it's hard to watch that game so going on to the next pack and we're gonna get another jonathan johnny goudreau that's like the fourth or fifth one i pulled as well but goudreau another seven thousand coins 101 available like availability that's pretty crazy nemeth murphy uh we got straight as well and nothing too good at the back. So not a bad pack. Another good, uh, solid 6,000, 7,000 coin pack. All right, so we're pretty much halfway through the pack. Pack opening, at least. And in this one, we're going to get Bogosian. We're going to get uh, Peter Mrazek. Not a rare gold uh, this year. But Franzen worth uh, 1,300. I guess I'll keep him. Bogosian, 1,000 coins. Don't exactly need him. But uh, if you guys are watching my Hut Roulette series, uh, you might have watched my last episode of... Uh, tripping everywhere episode. I'm pretty sure that they did patch that up So very soon I'm gonna post out another hot roulette You guys will probably see that and the games won't be too long Hopefully because last time it was like almost 40 minutes per per game and that's almost too much time to play a game And uh, I think they did patch it up. They did fix it So that's gonna be pretty good and in this pack we're gonna get Radom Verbata worth a little bit 2,900 coins not bad uh, Hainsey Hammond Hamburglar and, uh, oh, another Pittsburgh jersey. I don't have that one. Chicago changed team. And, yeah, all those jerseys are pretty much worthless at this point. Everybody's been pulling them, putting them back on the market, and they've been losing their value. And there we go. He accidentally sent some stuff to the collection. The guy sucks. You have to deal with it later. But we're going to go on to the 11th pack or something like that. We are pretty far into these packs already. And in this one, we're going to get... Oh, I see a team of the week in the background. I think you guys saw who that was, but I'll quickly scroll through it. Garbit Party Trotman. And in the back, we're going to get a Rafael Diaz. Is that his name, Ralph? Rafael Diaz, yep, that's his name. Twenty or He's only two available in the market. Nothing, no one has really sold him any, but I mean, the team of the week has only come out for like 45 minutes. So, Rafael Diaz, not bad, not a bad pickup at all. So, that's like the second team of the week this episode. Not too bad. And we're going to quick sell this pack, move on, and hopefully we can pull that Vladimir Tarasenko, pull one of those first liners in that team of the week. I'd like to see one of those guys. Come on. Show us a... Even a Ryan Johansson would be pretty nice. Come on. Let's see it. Uh, Kucherov. Nikita Kucherov. That's worth a little bit. Uh, let's quickly scroll through. See how much he's worth. 7,000 coins as well. Another 85 that's worth a little bit. And uh, once again, nothing in the back. Other than a Montreal change... Or a Montreal jersey. That's going to help out a little bit with the Montreal collection. Just don't have to worry about it. Let's quick sell this pack. Keep moving on. Alright, so I kind of do have something to talk about a little bit, uh, but I will be going through some video ideas with you guys and what you guys want to see first. You guys can post that in the comments as well, but right now I'm going to be uploading, hopefully, uh, new pack squads. I know some people were fans of pack squads from last year, and I want to bring that back because uh, it's a very fun series to do, actually. And in this pack, we're going to get Riley, uh, Backstrom, Clinkhammer. I saw some rare go uh, gold players at the back. Uh, Josh Georges, uh, just a fiddler, just a fiddler at the back. Send that to the collection. I also want to post out a face-off tutorial. I want to post a how to play defense and offense video. Uh, and I might actually try a GM mode or be a pro mode as well. So you guys can let me know which one you prefer more in the comment box below. I just had so many ideas. I don't know really where to start in terms of uh, making these videos. Because there's so many video ideas I want to pump out. But at the same time, like I don't want to start a series up and then not be able to finish it. Kind of like some of the ones I've already started before. Plus 5 all. Another Fiddler. Get out of here, Fiddler. Send that to the collection. But yeah, I want to base my uh, channel a little bit more towards tutorials and kind of teaching you guys how to play at this point. Because, like, I played 
hot roulette and stuff like that for almost like two years and like you know some of that stuff does get um not boring but it's like it, it's all about the same it's all the same in my opinion and uh oh what is that what player is that Semyon Barlamov, I thought that was like another Gabriel Landeskog, but 88 overall, Semyon Barlamov, that is a pretty sick card, Mark Shipley, uh, keep going here, Roman Polak, yeah, but anyways, uh, those are the video ideas I have in the future, <laughs> I wasn't too excited about the Semyon Barlamov, I should have had a little bit of a reaction, but yeah, those are the video ideas I'm going to be coming out with, and hopefully those will be out very soon in terms of, uh, timing because right now I'm pretty busy with midterms and stuff like that I know anybody that's in university right now it's getting pretty busy and look at that another 88 overall goalie Corey Crawford this time on the Chicago Blackhawks I will definitely take that Semyon Varlamov Corey Crawford uh, we pulled team of the week uh, who else do we pull oh and Tyler Myers 22,000 coins that's a 50,000 coin pack that is pretty sick we pulled some uh, pretty good team of the weeks. We pulled Charlie Coyle. We pulled uh, Rafael Diaz as well. Whole bunch of Johnny Goudreau's and Nikita Kucherov. And that is pretty much going to end off this pack opening. I'm probably missing someone in this pack. But anyways, that is pretty much it for this episode. We got lots of stuff to sell uh, for raising my coin total up for Hot Roulette. So that's going to be pretty nice. But anyways, that is about it guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave it a like if you do enjoy these pack openings. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. just about halfway uh, I want the people to be I guess deciding whether or not they should be rushing into the zone or if I should be shooting a puck it should be half and half I don't want my guys to be doing one thing more than the other because that does limit my own strategy what I want